Hello everyone, welcome to the Street Crime UK YouTube channel. Thank you for joining us. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more exciting true crime content. Today we look at a garage owner who was part of a plot to smuggle £37 million of heroin into the UK within a Jaguar and has been jailed for 19 years. The 230 kilos of Class A drug had been hidden in a series of secret compartments inside a specially adapted X-Type Jaguar car that arrived at the port of Felixstowe on a container ship from Pakistan, the court was told. The drugs were concealed in the bumpers, wheel arches, dashboard, central console, spare wheel compartment, engine and rear seating of the vehicle. The battered old car had no ignition or electrics and couldn't be driven. Paperwork with the vehicle claimed it had been shipped to the UK to be repaired, but investigators were able to find the drugs after the Jaguar was scanned with x-ray equipment and its secret cargo was revealed in a series of pictures. Atik Sami, 44, was the third member of a drug smuggling crime gang to be jailed over the plot when he was locked up. Mr Sami of Walden Way, Ilford was found guilty of conspiring to import the supply of heroin following a trial at Luton Crown Court. His conviction follows the sentencing of two other men, Noman Qureshi, 32 from Bradford, and Israr Khan from 35 from Luton in October last year. They were sentenced to 21 and 18 years respectively. What the smugglers hadn't realised was that they were already under surveillance by a crack team from the National Crime Agency soon after the container ship arrived at the port in Suffolk in December 2013. On the evening of Friday, December the 6th, 2013, Qureshi drove his car home from Bradford, picked up Khan in Luton and drove to a hotel in Ilford. Mr Sammy arrived in his Porsche 911 to meet them to discuss where to unload the heroin from the car. The Jaguar had been shipped to the UK from Pakistan and was driven on the back of a low loader to an address in Dagenham during the early hours of December the 7th. Mr Qureshi and Khan met it, but shortly left the scene after. They were arrested later that morning in Luton. The Jaguar was seized and examined by specialist border force search officers. They recovered 316 separate packages of heroin totaling 230 kilos. If cut and sold, the drugs would have had a likely potential street value of £37.2 million. Pounds. Mr Sammy was arrested in February 2014. NCA investigators linked him to a phone that had regularly been used to contact Mr Qureshi prior to the heroin importation. National Crime Agency Branch Commander David Norris said Mr Sammy played a crucial part in his conspiracy. His role would have been to recover the drugs concealed within the car. This group had international contacts and planned to import hundreds of kilos of high purity heroin to the UK in what was a quite remarkable smuggling attempt. The car in which the drugs were hidden had virtually every spare bit of space filled with heroin, but they were unaware their moves were being monitored by NCA investigators who prevented them from pitting these harmful drugs on the street. What do you think about their plan to move 37 million pounds of heroin inside of an old car into the UK? Thanks for joining us today. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a like and a share, and leave any thoughts or suggestions you have in the comments section. We love to read through them all. And if you're new but enjoy UK true crime content, then subscribe to see when our newest video releases. And as always, stay safe.